Yeah, no, this Hubble tension that people are struggling with today is exactly something that also may point toward a dynamical value. So we'll we'll see. But uh, yes, their true test of a version of gravity that you fully understand with quantum mechanics included would be a calculation of the cosmological constant and get a number. Are you and your people smart enough to get this figured out? I don't think so. (laughs) <laughs> and that's so sure. <laughs> Good answer. Because you know I've, I've dragged you over yeah, the coal. Yeah, we have come full circle. Because I told him, I said, look, you know, uh, Einstein came up with general relativity in 10 years by himself. You, you strength theorists, there's dozens of you have been working on this for decades. Either you're all wrong or you're all just too stupid to figure it out. And it's probably a combination. <laughs> <laughs> Love you, man, Brian. Thanks for coming back. My pleasure. To Star Thank Talk. You. Always good, Chuck. So great. Chuck, we'll find you in the hospital. Bless you will. <laughs> I'm, I'm completely fried right now. I'm fried. <laughs> Just to take us out, let me remind us all, we are in my office at the Hayden Planetarium of the American Museum of Natural History. The Cosmic Crib. The Cosmic Crib. And after this conversation we just had, I delight in realizing and celebrating the fact that just a a few pounds of organic matter inside of our heads can not only contemplate, but figure out how the universe works. And yes, we still have a long way to go. 